to women's rights. Women rights. And I'm not just speaking because I've chosen a young woman, Justina Wamai, 35 years old, yeah. with a husband, with a little kid. Women should be given a right to choose mm -hmm. when they give birth. Because that's another employment and they will be paid. Mgombe wa kiti cha uraisi kupitia chama cha Roots Party, Prof. George Wajakoya. Ameahidi kwamba ikiwa atashinda kura za agosti. Wanawake wote wajawazito watapata marupurupu mengi ili kukidhi mahitaji yao katika safari yao yote ya ujawazito. Wakati wa mahojiano ya kipindi cha asubuhi katika NTV, Wajakoya alisema kwamba iwapo atashinda uchaguzi mkuu wa mwezi wa agosti tare tisa. Wanawake wajawazito watabadilika na kuwa mradi wa serikali hadi watakapojifungua. Wajakoya alisema kuwa wanawake wajawazito watatua tu ushahidi wa kisayansi kwamba wao ni wajawazito na serikali itahakisha kwamba wanapata marupurupu ya kuendeleza. The day she gets pregnant and there's scientific evidence to show that she's pregnant, we shall start paying her a stipend because she will become now a state project right from the time she becomes pregnant. Right. So these are the rules and regulations we will be there, but we want to take care of a mother right from the time of inception of a child, the time she gives birth. Hivyo ndivyo alisema. Alipoulizwa ni vipi serikali itapata pesa hizi zote, Professor George Ojakoya alisema kwamba anaamini kuwa serikali yake ya Roots Party itapata pesa za kutosha kutokana na mauzo ya bangi. Aliongezea na kusema kwamba serikali yake itahakikisha kuwa akina mama watahudumiwa tangu uh, watakapopata ujauzito hadi watakapojifungua. And we feel that we shall give them enough money because we shall have enough money for marijuana. Okay. Take care of their health care regardless of whether they are working or not. That will be a prerogative of the, of, of the government. Haya ya Najiri siku chache baada profesa huyu kusema kuwa atazindua uuzaji wa nyama ya mbwa nje ya inchi ili kupata mtaji wa kutosha. Agenda yake hata hivyo iliibua wasiwasi mwingi. Huku wa Kenya wengi wakiwa na wasiwasi kuhusu matokeo ya inchi inayokuza bangi. Hata hivyo hili halijamzuia profesa huyu kutetea ajenda yake katika kuuza sera zake kwa wakenya. Baadhi ya vijana wamekuwa kipenda sana ajenda ya profesa George Wajakoya. Huku wengine wakiongezea kuwa maono yake ni muhimu katika kufufua uchumi wa Kenya unaokaribia kuzama. Wajakoya ameahidi kulipa deni la kigeni ndani ya miaka michache ofisini. Pia alisema iwapo atashinda anasimamisha katiba na mahakama. We, huyo tu ni Professor George Wajakoya. Anyway, what are your thoughts about Professor? Unaweza tuacha moni yako kwenye comment section utuambie. Thanks for watching. Let's meet next time and I am your favorite host Chief Okuzo.